Hello, boys and girls. Welcome to our math lesson. Our topic is ascending and descending order to 300. I'm Mrs. Cunningham and I am excited for you to begin. Let's go. We are going to jump right into some vocabulary. Ascending order is when the numbers are getting bigger. Example, 264, 265, 266. Now let's look at descending order. Descending order is when the numbers are getting smaller. Example, 235, 234, 233. Here is something I want you to remember. Remember that descending goes down, but ascending goes up. Can you say that with me? Descending goes down, ascending goes up. All right, boys and girls, we already know that ascending order is when the numbers are getting bigger. But I want you to also know that when you write numbers in ascending order, I need you to begin with the smallest number and end with the biggest number. Okay, we already know that descending order is when the numbers are getting smaller. That means when we write numbers in descending order, I need you to begin with the biggest number and end with the smallest number. I need your help. Help me write the numbers in descending order. Let's read the numbers. 283, 282, 281, 284. Can you help me write the numbers in descending order? Remember, when you write numbers in descending order, start with the biggest number and end with the smallest number. Yes, we should write the number 284 first because that is the biggest number. What will the other numbers be and in what order? Yes, our next number should be 283. Then 282. Last 281 because that is the smallest number and we should always end with the smallest number when we are writing numbers in descending order. You all did such an awesome job with that last practice question. I know this is going to be a piece of cake. Help me write the numbers in ascending order. Read the numbers. 201, 203, 204, 202. Remember, 
when we write numbers in ascending order, begin with the smallest number and end with the biggest number. What number should we write first? That's right, 201, because it is the smallest number. What number should come next? Yes, 202. Then 203. What about the last number? 204, because that is the biggest number. Great job, everybody. Write the numbers in ascending order. Let's read the numbers. 249, 298, 214, 289. What number should we write first? Yes, we should write 214 first. What should come next? 249. Then 289. Last, we should write 298. We have some more to do. We are going to write these numbers in descending order. I hope you're ready. Read the numbers. 273, 237, 300, that's a big one, 257. What number should we write first? That's correct. We should write the number 300 first. Next, 273. Then, 257. And our last number should be 237. Great job. We are writing the numbers in ascending order. Pick the missing number. In the box we have 300, the missing number, 257, and last, 237. Can you guess the missing number? That's correct, 279. You did such an amazing job and I am looking forward to another lesson with you. Bye.